Hi everyone, the spring capsule just launched and so I wanted to take a minute to go through each of the items that are in the spring capsule. It's 20 items, you can make hundreds of outfits with these and let's get started. This item is a basic white t-shirt. This is actually just a Hanes men's undershirt. If you are on a budget, this is a great shirt to wear. I learned this from Brighton Butler um, years ago and honestly, go grab this from your husband's closet. Be watching throughout the video for my three essential items. If you can't buy anything else, buy these three things. I'll be sharing them all throughout the video. Another option that I love is this Madewell Whisper t-shirt. Now, this is in black, obviously. When I get a white basic t-shirt, I like to get the v-neck version. For black, I usually do crew neck. These are all linked on the blog um, and on my Like to Know It page, but great starting thing. So this is your first piece. If you buy anything else, buy a basic white t-shirt. I don't care if it's the Hanes one that's super cheap or this Mabel one that's around a $20 price point. White or chambray collared shirt. You can wear these in a variety of ways. Um, this one is actually really old. Um, it's just the distressed one from Madewell. It's my go-to pick and I've linked a similar one on the blog that you can purchase now. And this is just a Gap basic white t-shirt. I've got a bunch of different price points on these. Find one that fits your body, your style, but likely you have one of these already hanging in your closet. One of the things that's most intimidating to people when they start a capsule wardrobe is they feel like they need to buy all new things. That's a huge myth. You can shop your own closet, and in fact, that's exactly where you should start. Shop your own closet. Use the shopping list provided in the post, and I'll link it below as well, but use that as your guide and shop your closet first, and then fill in the remaining items if you Next need to. Next I wanna share is a striped top. You can go long sleeve or short sleeve. For spring capsule, I chose this short sleeve one that I can layer easily with a denim jacket. A really versatile piece can go with black, white, or regular denim and heels. Looking to add something new to your closet this season, I'm recommending a short sleeve and a long sleeve, feminine top, ruffle, smock, look for that kind of thing, puff sleeve, something really feminine and soft for the season. Um, you know, I usually go neutral colors, but I am Whoa, watch out, branching out, brown and a light purple. It's really hard for me, but here I am. Um, this is a Madewell top and this one's from Nordstrom. I'll link both of them, but I also linked a bunch of different options for you so you can hopefully find something that fits your body type, your style, and your budget. And this next item, if you follow me for a while, you've seen it before. I bought this during the Nordstrom sale. It is a neutral sweater that I have worn for the last three out of four seasons. It is a great year round sweater. Um, it is a basic crew neck. It's cashmere and wool, so it's really breathable. It doesn't pill. I've loved it, highly recommend. It is a bit of a splurge, so I've linked save options as well, but as you're going. Okay, the next item, I'm wearing it today, is just this oversized, and I guess not really oversized, but this crew neck neutral sweatshirt. You can pair this with athletic pants, you can pair it with any of the denim, white, black, the Nate, or, uh, regular denim that I have on now, and even with shorts. It is a great casual, cozy option, wear around the house, but still feel pulled together. Okay, the next item, and I shared this last summer, and I think it's a great add-on for spring, some type of summer sweater or short sleeve sweater. This is a great piece for spring. This is the Amazon Save option and this is the splurge option from Madewell. It's beautiful. It has buttons down the back. Um, highly recommend this can be dressed up or down. On the tops is a long sweater option. This one was from Target two years ago. I've linked a bunch of similar options on the blog. Likely you have something from the fall that will work. I just recommend picking something that's a little lighter weight. You don't want like a heavy bulky sweater material, something a little thinner, something in a lighter color for spring just to make that transition. Um, but just finding a neutral, longer sweater. This yeah. one would be in spring without the denim jacket. This one's from Able. I've linked a bunch of basic denim jackets. You likely have one stowed away in your closet. And if you don't, this might be something to look for this season. On to bottom. So this season we're seeing, like we've, I've shared with the tops, the ruffles. Ruffle shorts are a great option. These are actually from several years ago, but I've linked a similar pair on Amazon. They're only $20. Super comfy, throw on a t-shirt with them, but throw on a t-shirt and heels, 
and you're ready to go on a little date. So again, going with the feminine touches of the ruffles this season. Next are jean shorts. There are two pair of jean shorts that I highly recommend. One is by A Gold, they're the Park, or excuse me, one is by AG, they're the Parker Swap Meet Shorts. I'll link those below. They are a splurge, but totally worth it in my opinion. This is a pair I bought last year. These are by AG as well. This is the Alexis short. These are a little bit shorter than the Parker Swap Meet and they're kind of like a wedgie cut. Um, so if you want something a little more conservative, I definitely recommend the Parker Swap Meet. I know it's hard to find denim shorts. I went on a huge hunt last year and shared all of that with y'all. And this is what I found from it. Let's talk denim. My favorite brand of denim is Madewell. They fit me really well and the price point is something I can afford. These are the 10 inch high rise. I also love the perfect vintage jean. I've had both of them. I have bought several pairs of these and love all of them. For spring, I'm re recommending three types of denim, just your regular standard blue jean, black denim, and white. And that is one of the, that is the second item I would recommend that you absolutely have to find. If you have three items to buy, buy the first one, which I make recommend was the white t-shirt, and then find yourself a pair of jeans that makes you feel amazing. Three pairs of shoes that I include in the capsule wardrobe for this spring, keep it really simple. So the first is just a basic pair of white tennies. These are the Reebok Classics. I love them. A lot of people like Golden Goose. That hasn't been in the budget for me, but I hear wonderful things about those. I've linked a bunch of different white tennis shoe options at a variety of price points. So hopefully, if you don't already have some in your closet, you can find some this season. Are a pair of neutral slides that you can wear with everything. These are and that's the third item. If you can get a pair of neutral slides, a really good fitting pair of jeans, and a basic white t-shirt, you will be set for so many outfits this spring. Last year, I found some really good ones that are similar on Amazon The Drop that I've linked below for you. But any pair of neutral slides, you probably already have some in your closet, will do. And then the third pair are a pair of neutral heeled sandals. I've linked several pairs for you guys. Um, these can dress up any of your your outfits for spring. Three front, I think a headband would be really cute. Um, and I always love a straw bag for spring. I've linked a couple below that you might like for yourself or you may already have one in your closet. And of course, I didn't add this as part of the capsule, but just a basic leather bag for spring is also a great option if you don't already have a straw bag. That's the 2022 spring capsule. Be sure to head to the blog to see the full guide and subscribe for more videos from Organized Nashville.